Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am DL Samuels, your friendly neighborhood spider, I mean photographer and retoucher. In this video, I'll show you how I save or export my images for Facebook, Instagram, or even Twitter without sacrificing quality. So after you have finished your retouching and saved the PSD file for the full resolution image, because you don't want to do all of this, and then didn't realize, oh, I didn't save the full resolution in Photoshop. So the first thing we're gonna do is go to image, then image size, and then we input 2048 on the long side. This is a portrait slash vertical image. The long side will be the height, 2048. click OK. Let me just show you what it what it would look like on a vertical slash landscape image. The longest side will be the width and also ensure that the sample is set to by cubic smoother. Why 2048? I'm not gonna tell you. That's your homework. You figure it out. Then come back to me and comment in the description below why 2048. And the next step is to go into file then export save for web legacy be ensure that it is set as JPEG you can set it as any other one that you like maximum quality and the range between 90 to 100 is a perfectly awesome range and ensure that the optimize is checked Convert to sRGB, ensure that is checked as well. And you will see the image size will reflect the same and keep quality as by cubic. And then you press save. And that's it. That is how I save my images. So they retain quality, they retain sharpness whenever I'm uploading to Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Tumblr, even on your website why we need to resize the images because social media usually resize images when you're uploading them so if we resize the images beforehand they don't have to i'll see you guys in the next video i'll show you how i sharpen my images in photoshop um remember to like subscribe um share with your friends share with all the photographers